Good morning and uh, welcome to the first week of Lent. Uh, just a few things I wanted to go over uh, that we have uh, uh, offered uh, in this Lenten season. Every Friday we have a holy hour and that will be from 4.30 p.m. to 5.30 p.m. with an opportunity to uh, pray the Divine Mercy Chaplet uh, along with adoration and uh, there will also be opportunity for, uh, for confession. Uh, and then from 5.30 to 6 p.m. we'll have our Stations of the Cross and uh, the, all those things will be on the screen so you can follow along quite easily even in this time of pandemic. And uh, actually starting today, we have the novena that begins to St. Catherine Drexel. Uh, and if you'd like more information about that, please uh, look at our website. That will be on our website today. The novena is St. Catherine Drexel. And next Wednesday, which is March 3rd, uh, is the feast day of St. Catherine Drexel. So besides adoration all day from 8 a.m. to 6 p.m., we will have a mass at 7.30 a.m., 7.30 a.m., and a special mass at uh, 7 p.m. The following Wednesday, March 10th, uh, we will be taking our turn in the 40 Days for Life to pray across from Planned Parenthood, and that's March 10th from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m., so please sign up for that. Uh, we encourage that. And uh, finally, uh, this is the year of St. Joseph as uh, decreed by uh, Pope Francis. And uh, we may have noticed this past weekend, we started saying a special, very ancient prayer of St. Joseph that we'll be praying uh, probably through the Latin season and various times throughout the year. And also uh, this year, we hope to... Uh, well, our plan is to have a statue to accompany Mary, a statue of St. Joseph carrying the child Jesus. And uh, that also, you should be able to view that on the website, and we probably will have something on that in this Friday's clock note as well. Um, but you'll be able to view a rendering of the statue, and uh, I know many people have already said they would like to contribute to that. Well, this will be an opportunity for individuals or groups to um, make contributions to our St. Joseph statue, which I think uh, will be one more uh, beautiful work of art and uh, a devotional piece to enhance the life of our faith community. God bless you. Have a good first week of Lent.